The Visual Studio IDE supports adding JavaScript code into the ASP.NET file. Here in this code sample, we have a um, user interface that includes a text field, button, text field, the equal sign, and another text field. Here we can mark the button and then in the properties window we can uh, assign a value to the attribute on client click. It can be a call to a JavaScript function that we shall define inside this very same code file. So we can then go up and add a JavaScript code and place a definition for the function my simple func. And here within the definition of this function we can place code such as alert welcome. Now if I execute this new ASP.NET file this is the output I get. As you can see I have a text field, a button, a text field, the equal sign, and another text field. If I check the source code, I can find the JavaScript code I added. I can also find an HTML file that create the button with the well-known onClick attribute for handling the click event for that button and on click is assigned with my simple func and of course the braces in order to call that function and if I check I can see that it works